a very good evening to one and all. Welcome to today's webinar, an insight into fashion design. Thank you for joining us today for the webinar. Mission Skills is an initiative of TJ's BK Birla College and Nest Academy for encouraging and aspiring young minds to develop and enhance their next-gen skills. This initiative is for the youth from country across, uh, for students across the country. I would like to welcome respected director, Dr. Naresh Chandra, sir, principal, Dr. Avinash Patan, sir, and Dr. Harish Dubey. I would now request Dr. Harish Dubey to please speak a few words on today's session. Thank you, Maria, ma'am. So at the outset, I would like to extend a warm welcome to Mrs. Nutan, a renowned and well-known personality in the field of fashion design. When I was going through her bad data, I thought that she is the most suitable person for the today's session. So on behalf of BK Birla College, our management, director, principal, students, teachers, everyone, I extend a warm welcome to you, ma'am. About Birla College, let me tell you, friends, Birla College has always believed in the holistic development of the students. Although we teach the subjects like BA, BSc, BCom, then Computer Science, BSc, IT, Data Science, there are so many courses. Birla College is a multi-faculty institution. But at the same time, we believe in the overall development. We want to give exposure to the students in almost all the fields, whether it is there at the college or not. But we want to give the students about the insight of various kind of uh, new courses as well. So today we thought that let us have a co uh, uh, lecture or a session on an insight on fashion design. And that is how we have requested Newton ma'am to please enlighten us on her expertise in the field of fashion design. So once again, I welcome you ma'am on behalf of BK Birla College. I am sure that this fashion design is a very fascinating and very interesting field for the younger generation. Fashion has always been a very kind of a, a interesting field, but nowadays it has come up more uh, professionally. And in fact, now we can see that there, there is a scope of career also in the field of fashion design. So I think we would like to listen to Nutan ma'am as far as possible. And again, we shall meet at the end. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Uh, in India, fashion is the most emerging industry. People are concerned about choosing designer outfits and want to look the best for every occasion. Fashion designing is one of the one of the extremely lucrative and glamorous career options and open doors to opportunities for everyone with a passion in this field. Today, uh, one may choose to specialize in any one of the subfields of fashion. The options are limitless. And to guide us further on this, we have with us Ms. Uh, Mrs. Nutan Kajpaje. It gives me immense pleasure to welcome you, ma'am, today. Uh, our expert speaker, Mrs. Nutan Kajpaje, has over 30 years of experience and has worked with fashion department with fashion departments of international fashion schools like WLCI College, Mumbai, Wigan and Lee College, UK, Cambrian College of Canada, Huddersfield University, UK, at the Mumbai campus and more. As a part of the academic team for fashion technology, she teaches core subjects like pattern making, garment constructions and uh, garment construction and fashion presentation, textile studies, material exploration, etc. Newton ma'am, on behalf of the entire team of Fashion Skills and BK Birla College, I welcome you for today's webinar. And I guess without wasting any further time, I would like to hand over the session to Newton ma'am. Um, is my audio clear? All of you can hear? Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, good evening to all, one and all, and thank you very much, BK Birla College uh, faculty members, principal, and uh, vice uh, chancellor, for inviting me for this session. Thanks a lot. 
uh, it was really a great pleasure to address to uh, the new generation uh, in the field of fashion. And as the fashion is changing a lot, we, the students, uh, it's a very popular subject and glamorous sub, uh, subject. So everybody's interested in knowing about uh, career scopes in this. Uh, talking about myself, let me just give you a little brief about myself. Uh, I have done my, I'm a textile, professionally textile and a fashion designer. Uh, done my programs in fashion and textiles. Um, after uh, I have my own brand called Lucas Fashions and uh, been working with the, in the industry for the last 30 plus years. Uh, associated with renowned fashion colleges like WLC College as uh, Huddersfield University and Cambrian Canadian College. Currently, uh, I'm working with a brand called Tisser, which is a handloom and ha uh, handloom and uh, handicraft brand, and uh, associated with Amity University as to mentor their students. Okay, um, as you all know, the fashion is very glamorous, and you all like fashion, love, dress up well. So many of you would like to get into the industry of fashion, and today we are going to talk about what are the different prospects and what are the different career opportunity in the fashion. Uh, since I'm, I'm talking about plus 30 plus years experience in the fashion industry, uh, what I've seen 30 years back and what I see now, there's a vast difference. Uh, when we passed out, there were only few opportunities, only as a designer working with the export houses. But uh, the age, it's really a digital age and the, everything has changed a lot. And the career opportunities are almost uh, extended about 10 to 15 times more. So now today we are going to talk about career opportunities. And I believe all the students of BK Birla College today who are attending this session are from science, commerce, arts, and various other backgrounds. That's what Arish sir told me today. And I think after you all must be doing your 12th, must be in the first year, second year, and uh, maybe graduating in a year's time, or maybe graduating this year. And uh, how are we going to do, how are we going to select a career if we have done your graduation in BA, BCom, and uh, science? What are the career opportunities after that in the industry of fashion is something which I would like to discuss about. Uh, so today, uh, can we have a next slide, please? Uh, Amit, sir. OK. So today we are going to talk about various career opportunities uh, in the industry of fashion. When we talk about fashion, what is fashion? First of all, can uh, any student talk about, uh, tell me something when it we, we sort of say fashion, what does it come in your mind? What is fashion? Everybody likes dressing up. Everybody likes looking good. So fashion is something, clothing and exercising and living a different lifestyle is something what we talk about in the fashion. And when we do that, everybody does wear different clothes. Everybody likes to wear clothes. So what? why do we need to learn fashion designing? And how do we go about creating a fashion for a particular uh, person or particular brand is something what is very interesting. Uh, when we talk about the fashion designing, uh, it's the art of designing clothing other uh, accessorizing for aesthetic and natural beauty. Students in the fashion design technology course learn their professional and personal skills must continually involve, make ambitious for the employ for employment. Now, when we talk about career, careers, we need to have a creative skills. Fashion is definitely a creative world. So we need to have a little bit of a creative skills, technical knowledge, because everybody thinks it's a glamorous. It must be very easy. Just draw, sketch, and banado. There are lots of technical aspects also involved in this. Can we have a next slide, Amit, please? Okay. As we see here, India Indians spent almost 5,500 billion on purchasing clothes. They spent already in 2018, and they must have done in 2021. It is estimated around. $108 billion and expected to reach $223 billion by 2021. The textile industry is also one of the largest contribution to India's export and approximately about 13.5%. Now, let's. this is a little technical, but it's a 
one of the uh, fashion industry it has a major part and role in uh, country's financial growth economic growth okay so higher why did why why it is in last few years like that uh, why why is fashion growing up in last few years one is the higher income disposable income infrastructure and opening of brands of different in different cities when uh, about 15 years back there were no malls of uh, 15 20 18 years back there were no malls there was only one mall everybody would like to go to mall or uh, see but high street fashion was there like the people would go and just buy on the regular uh, shops but now everything is available all international brands are coming to every mall and in, in india and we we look forward to buying something in international brand okay the next slide please okay we have kids there are major segments in the fashion industry one is men's segment women segment and kids in there there are three major categories and in the major uh, this thing women segment is one of the and men segment shares the equal part than the kids segment but people do spend more money on kids segment also so it's quite lucrative the business is quite good definitely when we talk about covid 19 and the further career of uh, further business there are little challenges but then the, nobody roti kapda makan is something which is very uh, very essential uh, this thing uh, so fashion is not going to go it out so everybody will start working on fashion after covid what is going to be the fashion everybody is talking about that also so fashion is not going to go but the fashion will change so we are going to learn about that also so about how the fashion would change also next slide please amit ji there are fashion is a lifestyle also it's not only a design it is a technology involved so when we talk about technology how are we going to when we design something so we need a, there are creative aspect there is a technology aspect and there is a marketing aspect when we talk about a product development koi bhi ek design banate hai usko design banane ke liye kya creative aspect chahiye uske baad mein usko टेक्निकल बनाते समय डिजाइन के बाद में उसको बनाने के लिए अच्छे बनाने के लिए क्या स्किल्स चाहिए इज समथिंग व्हाट वी लर्न इन द फैशन इंडस्ट्री एंड देन आफ्टर डूइंग दैट हाउ वी सेल सो देर आर थ्री सेक्टर सेक्शन इन्वॉल्व सो हियर व्हेन वी टॉक अबाउट बीए बीकॉम एंड कॉमर्स बैकग्राउंड स्टूडेंट आर्ट बैकग्राउंड स्टूडेंट एंड साइंस बैकग्राउंड स्टूडेंट ऑल द थ्री स्टूडेंट हाउ विल दे बी एबल टू रिलेट टू दिस पर्टिकुलर फील्ड इज समथिंग आई वुड लाइक टू गिव यू लिटिल इंसाइट student from art background and uh, if suppose you are doing your pursuing your career in arts and uh, you want to do your you want to some pursue your career, uh, professional career in uh, fashion how what are the or career opportunities there for you so students with the art background has a, a first of all in the art section you have your literature you have your history you have psychology these are major subjects in your arts be a background so when we talk about uh, taking up fashion how the subjects are related to fashion so uh, first of all literature when you are talking about literature or writing a communication skills lots of magazines lots of communication is required when you are doing uh, when you are doing your creative skills so you need to express yourself so you so after they take doing your ba bcom you can always get into a creative skills of fashion in case of Uh, communication fashion communication courses then we talk about commerce students coming from commerce marketing and ma ma management is very ma major skill in the retail industry and fashion industry and along with that when we talk about science students technically how would they uh, be involved in the fashion industry what they want to do how do you, do you think it is after doing basic it is uh, good or no, not uh, is it something which you can do this program or no yes after doing bsc in fact there are lots of technical aspects of the fashion industry which all bsc to uh, engineering and bsc students they prefer taking of fashion because it's really very uh, important for them to know the uh, uh, their knowledge of science gives them an insight of how the product development the product making is done so how we going to go into the next uh, slide amit ji the student enables 
a professional fashion designer work in the industry of apparel buying houses export houses garment manufacturing fashion retail stores online fashion business these are the career opportunities for the students who have completed their fashion design and who have taken up a few courses in fashion next please the kind of students who are would like to do fashion designing these are the first certain few career as prospects which i'll be discussing as a fashion designer they work in the industry they work as a merchandiser what is merchandiser merchandiser means once you design a particular uh, dress how would you execute this is what the technical knowledge of science students or commerce students would like to get into this particular field merchandiser apparel buying houses and export houses require the profile of merchandiser visual merchandiser and fashion consultant uh other again coming up very uh, big scale uh, as especially fashion image consultants a very big section uh, sector in the industry of fashion online fashion blogger as a stylist as an entrepreneur to open up their own business also next slide you see a famous designer here mr manish malhotra which everybody knows about him so when we talk about a fashion designer there are so many designers you can uh, you must be knowing about like neeta lula is there manish malhotra is there so what are the success stories of there how do they design so how would you they hire designers junior designers and their sister junior designers assist them for the with uh, for the collection making so as a fashion designer you can work with the designers next please. as a merchandiser if you want to work here in export houses design houses you can work as i said a technical person you can work as a technical person in the export houses next fashion visual merchandising now visual merchandising is one as a fashion designer after doing the course there is a uh, there is a area of visual merchandising where you are doing a uh display work and how would you say because aap kuch bhi cheez banao to usko sale to karni padti hai sale karne ke liye uske liye presentation you need to know the presentation skills you need to know how to uh, promote your product so how would you put it in what positions would you do? so visual merchandising is something how display art of display in a proper manner next as an entrepreneur having your own setup which i was telling you it's one of and everybody wants to do a fashion business everybody can have their own any uh, as you as a skill there are two ways of looking at it you create your own collection and you sell out to somebody else's collection so there are two so there both the professions you require to know you need to know the uh, understand the fashion color sense you need to understand the technical the fabric textile sense of it and uh, how the fits cuts and everything would fit so in your entrepreneur business it's overall understanding of textile and all uh, design textile fashion design color schemes and uh, how would you dress a, a person how if you have to make a different product how would you design a particular product for a particular season is something what you will be doing it in your entrepreneur real business next please event professional now uh, as a fashion designer there are many events happening all in the country and all worldwide where we have a fashion shows one of the major one then uh, lots of exhibitions so as a fashion event professional you have a wide scope in the industry next please as a fashion blogger this is very interesting now everybody is tech savvy everybody is social media savvy and everybody likes to have lots of likes lots of followers and this is the work of fashion blogger who has who uh, blogs about the current situation particular subject and they talk about what is happening in the industry what what can be what can happen in the industry and they talk about what is in and around so it's a very on the social media platform fashion bloggers are very important all fashion designers are taking help of fashion bloggers to promote their businesses and that's how the fashion bloggers is one of the major 
career opportunity for the designer uh, fashion design students or students from little bit of a sense of fashion to talk about fashion and that's why the industry of the blogging blogging industry is really growing very very high next please now fashion styling what is fashion styling as a stylist uh, you all see lots of movies so in that movie a, a particular character is designed and how the costumes for the characters are designed you see a particular ad and the costumes for that particular ad is designed you see a particular uh, 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 what do you say uh, you a particular model and she needs a stylist for her own uh, uh, her own presentations so here the fashion stylist as a fashion stylist work for individuals fashion houses clothing brands them if you're talking about clothing brands the fashion stylist when they work for the clothing brand whatever is the production done the fashion stylist puts up on the uh, photo session they do the photo session and that time the fashion stylist styles the particular garment in a particular manner to give the uh, what do you say the subject that particular subject requires a ambience so the ambience is created by the fashion stylist next please image consultant uh, is one of the again the very important whereas in, when you have lots of celebrities and they need some or uh, somebody to promote their image so that's how where the students to know about the role and the responsibility of fashion stylist candidate will be able to de demonstrate the principles of fashion for individual cons consumer or group and customers so many a times uh, a fashion image consultant would always play a role in the uh, in an in individual's life to when they have a marketing or when they have to present themselves the image consultant gives them a look they create a look for that particular character as a, a client that's how the image consultancy consultant is a major important uh, field again next slide please now this is something we spoke about industry of fashion if you have any questions can we have a little bit of a question session or shall i can talk about the subjects what we can we can learn during the fashion design course okay then i think we should go to the next session of fashion subjects we talking about fashion design technology and the subjects in this so once you know the kind of subjects are there in the industry of fashion courses you will be able to uh, make a decision if you want to take up a course or really like to do something what we see what we start during the fashion courses can we have a next slide please okay now we talking about drawing so a uh, student who have a flair of art and would like to have no hope want to do something in drawing want have little skill in drawing hand skills in drawing can all they can always opt for this program and uh, drawing is a major part of this uh, fashion design uh, course which is design now as i said there is a there are two aspects of it one is fashion design one is fashion tech uh, te technology one is fashion communication and mark and one is fashion business so when we talk about these are different avenues student who are good at drawing skill who has a ha good hand skills can always get into this uh, as a designer and design the skill set of design so they they need they can draw well and they can these are the certain drawing skills are involved in the fashion program next again the designing student with the skill of creative skills who want to know what are the colors who want to understand the colors figure types who want to know uh, how to uh, paint and how to create a new design so that's how it is a fashion the basic designs a certain subjects of the elements and principles of design are there in the subjects of fashion next 
again this is a very important fashion model drawing and illustration is one of the subject in the skills of fashion design so student again i'll say about the students with the hand skills can this uh, would require this hand skills for this particular program next fashion design project where again the creative skills will be taken care next now this is this particular subject in the fashion design program is more technical subject actually up till now you are doing a lots of imagining with lots of thinking lots of um, uh, creative uh, creating thing but once it the your creation has to be implemented then we talk about certain technical knowledge and the pattern making is first thing which comes when you make create a garment we need to need to know how to do a pattern of it and how to create a stitch a garment so you need to have a little bit of a pattern making skills there so this is one of the major subject of uh, in the industry or uh, in the syllabus of fashion design next garment construction so basic uh, technical uh, basic wording for it is for sewing so construction of garment construction is a technical again a very technical uh, subject where you are after designing you are creating a product now at once you do up designing the product is created with a, a construction of knowledge of garment construction so garment is created after the garment construction knowledge next history of fashion design now everything what you learn has a history so this is fashion history is very vast subject and where you and learn lots of fashion what is what past of the fashion to create future there is always a base of the past and then how that's how you learn fashion history uh, in the history fashion history you learn how to create a new design get inspiration from fashion historical uh, context still referencing and create new collections next slide please now computer aided design this is one of the very major course in the fashion design uh, where you understand how to do uh, uh, students especially student who have lesser hand skills of drawing and how do they visually present their collection is through computer aided designing and it's one of the very uh, um, popular and the uh, very demanding course in the industry people who uh, all the students who has a knowledge of computer reading compu uh, computers and fashion illustration illustrator photoshop and different uh, softwares uh, has a very good uh, scope in the industry next please next textile design uh, in case of fashion uh, textile is a very basic uh, uh, product yeah basic base so when you know uh, textiles uh, without textiles without fabric you cannot make a dress so you one is a very important what when you making a dress you need uh, you need to have a textile design so textile under the textile design right from making of a yarn from particular fa um, particular fiber and from fiber to yarn to weaving knitting and making dyeing printing and designing product designing is something what you need learn in the textile design subject next please embroidery as a surface ornamentation one of the major uh, road major subject where you have lots of uh, uh, hand skills required and when you uh, when you require creative um, knowledge of it you can create designs by using embroideries and so you need to know the embroidery knowledge about it. the next one now fashion forecasting and what is happening there is always a forecast what is when you learn fashion a particular sub particular topic in forecasting is a global career that focuses on upcoming trends a fashion forecast predicts the colors fabric textures material print graphics grooming exercising footwear street so everything what you wear so you want a latest in everything what when you so when you talk about latest what do you mean by there is some kind of a forecasting is done uh, by international designers by in, and then they we get that latest things and new new designs which you see in the market is something what is by done in the fashion forecasting 
market research is very again a very important if you have to do your product line if you want to do your business or you want to do sales you need to have a market research so before creating you would like to know ki if i make a dress create kar rahi hu to mujhe dress create karne ke liye mujhe ye dress main kyu create kar rahi hu iska basics kya hai main ye kisko sell karne wala hu to market mein chalega ki nahi chalega ye market mein chalega to uski fab- fabric sahi hai ki nahi ये सब कुछ बिकॉज वेन यू टॉक अबाउट मास स्केल वेन यू टॉक अबाउट अ डिजाइन स्केल यू नीड टू हैव अ बेसिक यू नीड टू हैव अ सर्टन नॉलेज ऑफ वट इज वट विल हैपन वट विल सेल वट विल नॉट सेल फॉर दैट यू नीड टू डू अर रिसर्च सो मार्केट रिसर्च इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सब्जेक्ट नेक्स्ट लाइफ प्लीज ड्रेपिंग इज अगेन अ ट्रेक टेक्निकल सब्जेक्ट वेर इट इज वेन यू डू अ गार्मेंट ड्रेपिंग you uh, do it on the dummies and you make a product line there is a part of the pattern making and garment construction next slide fashion merchandising again as i told you as a merchandiser you need to have a lots of knowledge of promotion apparel sales involves all the task necessary to deliver the clothing request and meet the needs of potential customers and designers so as a merchandiser you are the mickey person where you will be working with designer and client so you have and the production team so you are the key person who works as a fashion merchant who works as a fashion merchandiser and uh, who coordinates with designer to production houses to sales people so that's a very important role of a fashion merchandiser next slide please fashion styling we spoke about it's a subject where uh, you are styling and you understanding one of the most popular emerging professional in the industry world globally and it is the job of the someone who has likes the clothing and accessorizing published see so now fashion styling when you're talking about when you do uh, when you talk about magazine when you do a you see a magazine in the magazine also or in the media field or TV channel, um, this thing, um, you see lots of characters are designed. So, as a fashion styling stylist, you need to have a fashion styling subject in the course of fashion design. Next, please. Fashion photography is also one of the subject of the fashion course, and it has again a career as scope there. Fashion photography is general genre of fashion photography, which is. devoted as displaying clothing so visually when you see everything when you need to uh, show showcase your collection there are different ways of focus in the fashion photography is one of the major role again there next slide please these are certain projects which you work on by taking an inspiration here one of the you taking how do you take an inspiration how do you create a collection is something what you want to do next slide and in the end you display your project but you this is you display your project and you start getting your orders work on your collections and show your uh, portfolios to your clients and get your work done there next please thank you um maria ma'am do you we have any questions answer sessions now yes ma'am uh, firstly ma'am thank you so much for for giving that wonderful insight into the fashion industry definitely uh, i'm sure there is so much that the students have learned and you've opened up an entirely uh, you know uh, the different career options that students have so firstly thank you so much for go- giving us such a great insight into the fashion industry we'll now open up the session for a few question and uh, a q and a round i would like to inform all the students that you can put in your questions in the live comments and we'll be able to see your questions uh, in the meantime we have uh, a few questions uh, so uh, we can begin with those questions i'll try to cover up as much possible uh, depending upon the time that we have uh so ma'am first and foremost thing that i would like to ask you uh is that uh, when we speak about uh, fashion we are basically dealing with clients you're you're dealing with people uh so uh, can you throw some light or uh, light on client servicing in fa- in the fashion industry uh okay client servicing in fashion industry very very 
important question because then basically in the end uh, whatever you create if you don't spell then there is no uh, there is no uh, what do you say it's just not for the sake of making it you need to sell it so you need to understand when you're talking about plants you need to understand plants requirement but there are def definitely different types of plants so when we're talking about when i just was showing my presentation uh when you're talking about there are different um, sections like suppose you're working with the exporter when you're working with the media houses when you're working with a artist when you're working with personal clients when you we are working with a professional client like so uh, in my career i've come across when I, i was having my own boutique and when i was feeling so there i worked in a different sector so uh, when i was started my career and when i was dealing with a uh, professional like doctor now if i am talking about a doctor and definitely she is a human being he, he, he. and they would like to dress up but they, their profession is that so when they they need that dressing up uh, dressing up differently and throwing professional you there lawyers mm -hmm. uh, when you talk about education is so you cannot just wear anything and go anywhere so when you are talking about the first impression is the last impression you always said so when i am as a doctor when he see or she goes so the impression of the doctor is on her personality of his requir professional requirement and that's how you design or create a uh, on song for the uh, a client understanding their requirement so first you need to really understand if that for clients is client of yours is what profession he or she is into what is their requirement and then you design so there you will even uh, think of color schemes you will think of for uh, uh, body type you will think of for um, uh, uh, hair styles also many times there is, as a image consultant also as a fashion designer you work as an image consultant and you give a text to your client ki you aap aise pehno aap aise karo ye color aapke par suit hoga you need to understand the anatomy of the client you need to understand the uh, uh, what you say uh, skin tone of it to suggest a different color the color scheme which will look good on them mm -hmm. so client servicing is very important and uh, jaise main kehti hu ki kuch bhi bana lo paisa usme sell nahi karenge to kya fayda wo client लेना ही पड़ेगा तो क्लाइंट सर्विस के लिए थोड़ी सी बातें भी करना जरूरी है ओके सो एवरीबॉडी शुड नो हाउ टू कन्विंसिंग हाउ टू कन्विंसिंग पावर एंड टू कन्विंस समबडी यू नीड टू हैव इन डेप्थ नॉलेज राइट 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 सो जस्ट अगेन अनदर क्वेश्चन व्हिच इज रिलेटेड टू व्हाट यू जस्ट सेड definitely when we speak about fashion fashion is a very creative career option you know one has to be a little creative and think out of the box but apart from creativity what according to you are the necessary uh, skill aspects that you need to be a successful fashion designer okay um the successful fashion designer is not only creative it has to a uh, designer or a person has to have multi faceted talent, talent like uh, communication skill marketing skills business sense Okay. Mm. Then managing people very important. Right. You are you are dealing with two ends of of uh, people. As a fashion designer, I every day come across with masterjis and tailors. Okay. Now when I am coming with uh, come across with masterjis and tailors, unki language, unka means they come from a very different background. So unke saath dealing karna, unke saath unse kam karwa ke liye na. What how would you work with that? what communication skills do you have with them dealing with people managing people is very important uh, then you are working with a high profile client so that time or you are working with a business people when you are doing your business you need to uh, go to uh, make a uh, you have to uh, for you to sell your product so you need to convincing power you can also talk to them so you need to have a very good communication mm -hmm. managing people is very important right okay. skills so hr skills are also very important when you are recruiting somebody you need to know what skills he or she should have because so otherwise aapke business mein ya aapke uh, career and uh, aapke profession mein aapko right kind of log nahi milenge hmm hmm right uh ma'am uh, definitely in india fashion is one of the most emerging fields uh, and have a lot of career opportunities 
uh, but when we look at fashion in, in the global uh, sense what are the career opportunities that students have or uh, uh, you know in in the fashion career on the global platform see um, as i said ki the recent social media which is coming up hmm. so widely blogging and bloggers are uh, is very um, what do you say it's a very uh, emerging uh, profession and this uh, hmm. like communication skills hone hain understanding of fashion hona zaroori hai understanding of uh, as i said it is it's not only you need to know design you need to know design hmm. you just have to understand ki design kya hoti hai fashion kya hota hai it's not only clothing also it's even the psychologically hmm. how do you promote uh, a particular product is something so fashion blogging mein aapko baatein karni hai aapko baat uske bare mein likhna hai uske bare mein sochna hai uske bare mein aapko express karni hai so fashion blogging is very much upcoming uh, field now in mean, on a global scale right. and uh, you don't have to go everywhere it's you're sitting in front of your computer and you're talking about uh, कलेक्शन तो ब्लॉगिंग इज समथिंग वेरी वेरी उसके सिवा आजकल कुछ बिजनेस होते ही नहीं है फैशन ब्लॉगर बात नहीं करते हैं तो बिजनेस में उनको डिजाइनर्स को स्कोप नहीं होता है यस यस अम आल्सो टुडे ऑब्वियसली थिंग्स हैव चेंज्ड टेक्नोलॉजी हैज कम इनटू पिक्चर सोशल मीडिया इज अ वेरी इंपोर्टेंट रोल एज यू ब्राइटली सेड सो कैन यू आल्सो आई मीन थ्रो सम लाइट एज टू हाउ सोशल मीडिया कैन हेल्प हाउ कैन you keep your presence on social media and also use it for marketing um i think uske siwa to business nahi hai sales nahi hai hum apne bare mein batayenge nahi to kaise hoga so social media hmm. um, when the, uh, when i started my career there were only very few options as a media you only had a print media television hmm. and audio radio and audio. right uh, right now uh, facebook Instagram and there are many more, but major are Instagram. You know, Facebook is also a little less thing, but uh, Instagram. So, if you are not, you are not present, you are not your followers, so you are not. 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 whatever the things you do so social hmm. media is very it play it plays very uh, major role in uh, fashion hmm. design i mean uh, social media plays in every um, fashion is in every field i feel right uh, we have a student called shreya singh who is asking a question that how to start your own fashion store in with a less investment or with a small budget okay <laughs> um yes after the uh, investment in the sense thing first of all you need to have a product line which is very strong okay now you uh, as a designer during the once you do your program definitely the insight is given to you how what exactly you want to become but so um, you don't have to because after as you said social media and online media sales to it as you say and um, the digital uh, For you, for distribution, you can sell lots of, and there is that there are lots of sites like Amazon, Mintra, Flipkart, and many more. It's not these are just major players. So uh, you have your own collection. So you save on to your rent, you save on to your manpower, just to create a product. And production is the one thing, but production is also outsourced. So you minimum. If you your investment mm-hmm. like obviously दुकान नहीं है तो मेरा presence नहीं है मुझे मालूम नहीं मैं कहाँ बेच रही हूँ but आजकल मुझे दुकान की जरूरी है तो दुकान का rent भी नहीं है आजकल ये covid के इसके वजह से तो और भी है nobody is everybody is buying online everybody is going to be also if you just mm-hmm. need to have a very strong product so your investment in product is very important your investment in what you use right. to sell is very important so that डेफिनेटली यहाँ पे कम से कम इन्वेस्टमेंट हो गई बाकी बहुत सारे खर्चे भी कम हो गए Another student 
Phil X, if I hope I'm getting your uh, name right, who wants to know on um, about Fashion Illustrator? Uh, what is who is a Fashion Illustrator, and uh, how can you become a Fashion Illustrator? Okay, friends. Uh, there is a Illustrator. Fashion Illustrator is um, as I think in very nice slides. I've shown a few slides. Um, you need to have a uh, drawing skills basically. You need to uh, hmm. if you're good at your drawing. Definitely during your program, you've been taught how to do designing, well designing, illustration is a major subject also. So um, if, you want, if, you, if you want to become an illustrator, you have to definitely have a good drawing skills. Okay, drawing, rendering, painting. And definitely along, if you don't have your drawing skills, there are lots of software, the Photoshop is there, Illustrator is there. You can mm. create your uh, collection on Photoshop um, on the software and uh, become an illustrator. Now, where is this? What is the scope for an illustrator? Is very important. You become mm. illustrator definitely. You have skill. You become an illustrator. But what is the scope as an illustrator in the industry of fashion? Okay. Um, today, uh, if if you design a particular garment, the garment design is designed with a color. Fabric, texture, these are basic elements of design. And these elements say a quick product. Bandha. It's not only fashion garment, it's any product you design. Usme aapko mm -hmm. design ke elements hote hai. So elements may have a color, aata hai, shape, aata hai. Aad main mobile phone use kare. So mobile phone ka bhi ek shape, hai. mobile phone ka bhi ek color, hai. mobile phone ka bhi ek design. Hai. So uske liye, you have a sense of design. And that the sense of design up use that is on it as a industry may fashion illustrator. So, who sense of design hand skill ke lava, you can show it on the computer. And uh, they, they, it's a, they have a very good demand because uh, illustrator and illustration it's a visually up kya karne wale no aka product kya wo dikhane ki aka koi na pay. You need to show right show, giving an idea, before, yeah, before doing having a product in your hand. You need to show a product. How will it look? So you have a you right. have an idea. How will it be? So the skills are used right. as a illustrator. It's very important, and it's, a, it's definitely an illustration. Who, uh, illustrator is in, in every in this, uh, every fashion garment industry uh, garments uh, industry. There is an illustrator. So it's a very good. Mm -hmm. They have a very good skill there. I hope Felix okay. has uh, answered your question. Yes, I'm sure. Uh, mm. Ma'am, since fashion fashion is uh, ever changing and it is ever evolving, how important it is to keep oneself updated about fashion, and um, how should I mean, how, what are the ways in which you could keep yourself uh, as to what is currently going on in the fashion industry? Okay, um, definitely, uh, you have your Google. To know more what is happening, you have your, your social media presence, you have your Facebook, right. Instagram, who be naya aata hai, insta pe aata hai. But uske ilawa jo create karta hai, whoever creates, like you know, there are designers like for us. Suppose I'm working for a brand and I have to uh, hmm. launch a collection, new collection in the market. Okay, so hmm. mujhe main kya launch karna chahti hu? Mujhe kya sochna chahiye launch karte samay collection? Subset, I mean, as I said, the sales is very important. So my, whatever I'm hmm. going to be making, to sell it, I need to know what is happening in the market. So am I going to do hmm. what is happening in the market? Or am I going to create a product what will hap happen in the market? What is happening in the market hmm. is already happening. So I'm not going to create that. So as a fashion right. uh, designer, we need, there is a, a whole uh, science of fashion forecasting. Okay, mm -hmm. where we understand mm -hmm. the psychology, we take lots of play, uh, inspiration and we create our collection based on fashion forecast. Now, fashion forecast in India and fashion forecast abroad, there are different, uh, there is a gap. Okay. In India, we work on a seasons, we work on festival mm -hmm. seasons, work on, uh, we don't work on autumn, winter, and spring, spring summer. So climatic conditions seasonal uh, season in India. Mm. India is just a festival mm. season. Yeah, very important. Mm. Later. And then definitely a profession. For what you are going to wear your color. Uh, so you need to understand that my fashion forecast. That is, color. 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 Color.
that one point there was a uh, popular was green color was popular so how this that that green color comes so fashion for a uh, uh, fashion koi aata hai jo sochta hai ki nahi ye green color lana hai to uska jo istemal kiya jata hai jo social media mein ya any particular media uh, what is it uh, character ke upar it okay and then they start showcasing that color more everywhere and that's mm-hmm. what they were using fashion डिजाइनर्सिंगल इज दैट Now we're talking about internships and traineeships. Um, I think right. most of the colleges nowadays who are uh, offering the courses, they're offering internships and traineeships mm-hmm. during their program. And I'll come to the point your question, which is uh, how important it is and why one should mm-hmm. have an internship and traineeship. Okay, uh, there are two aspects: one you have a theory, and one you have a practical. What you learn in your mm-hmm. college. Okay, hmm. uh, it's theory, and means you learn hmm. during, however, in the college time. Really. But when it comes to actually uh, in the industry, the, it's a totally different. It's, it's your knowledge, your knowledge is used, but your skills are differently used there. Okay, hmm. so uh, every year, like you know, most of the colleges nowadays offer uh, internship. Uh, every year, because a student at every stage requires that knowledge. So, first year, the student, the second year, the student, the knowledge, different, different, right? So, they have different industries. So, and one is very important when you work with the industry, uh, as a, when you go as an internship, you yourself understand what do you want to do. Okay, it may be a very new fashion industry. I have seen about five or six major industries. So, in that, there are many industries. Okay, somebody wants to become an illustrator, but in and if he doesn't have he or she doesn't have a skill of illustration illustration then mm. it it becomes a failure so during your academic session or in during after completing your academic you should try for your or to go for internship and understand ki mujhe ye feel sahi hai kya main ye jo kaam kar raha hu fashion industry mein wo mere liye sahi hai kya ye apne aap ke liye it's very important so internship and then definitely anyway when you go for your final uh, this placement इंटर्नशिप में आपने क्या सीखा है कहाँ सीखा है वेर एवर यू हैव डन योर इंटर्नशिप विच प्लेस एंड दैट प्लेस अजर रोल इन योर फाइनल सिलेक्शन ड्यूरिंग योर फाइनल प्लेसमेंट व्हेन यू टेकिंग अप न्यू जॉब ओके सो यस प्रैक्टिकल अंडरस्टैंडिंग इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट कॉलेज में आप जो करते हैं उससे बहुत अलग होती है और अलग hmm, अलग इट्स इन एवरी सेक्टर इट्स नॉट ओनली वन डिजाइनर वन डिजाइनर मे बी वर्किंग इन वन वे इन द अदर डिजाइनर वे बी वर्किंग इन डिफरेंट वे टू डिफरेंट राइट कि कैसे करते हैं वो क्या काम करते हैं सेलिंग में भी मार्केटिंग में भी अलग अलग तरीके यूज किए जाते हैं तो अलग व्हेन यू टॉक अबाउट वर्किंग विद अ प्रैक्टिकल एक्सपीरियंस आने के लिए तो यू हैव टू वर्क विद एनी वन एंड नॉट ओनली वन और टू लाइक If you are saying, if you want to become a, and one thing you need to suppose, if you want to become a marketing into getting the fashion marketing, so try to choose your internship into that sector first. Hmm. Understand, hmm. and that's why if you don't like it, or if you think that I will not be able to come work here, I, this is something what I have not thought of. Because up, during your academic, you think differently. You, know, you think, no, I want to be a designer. 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 I want to become an India's top designer like a Manish Malhotra. Okay, Manish Malhotra is there, but in that case, Manish Malhotra, you have to reach there. You have to know what you have to do. You have to practical knowledge, practically, you are not doing anything. So you know. <laughs> yes. Also, it broadens one understanding and perspectives. Also, you know about what yes, is I'm, there in the industry. Yeah. So, yeah. So. Yeah. yeah. uh felix has another question ma'am he wants to know if there is any particular type of course that one has to do to be a fashion illustrator um yeah there is there are many it's not only one hmm. uh, most of the colleges uh, see there are in your two years 
I, I don't know, Felix, which uh, are you a graduate or undergraduate? If you're doing your, done your 12th and you want to do simultaneously with your career, I, did, I have no idea. Uh, but as a fashion illustrator, uh, once you, as I said, you have to master your skills of hand skills. Drawing, painting, is a lot of work. And uh, well, as, uh, the weightage in the program is about 25 to 30 percent. So you, during your academic session only you learn. And it's gradually over the period of three years or two years go to by practice you master the skills of this illustration. Hmm. 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 And there are uh, also courses also, as I said, there are very many courses. Uh, if you go in various colleges, there are fashion illustration, there are private tutors also teaching fashion illustration program. So it's not only that you need to go to college, but if you have your if you know your drawing skills, you know if you are like drawing and painting. It's always good to point. Uh, there's another question from Karan who asked that how um, how can we work with uh, fashion brands as fashion designers or stylists? Fashion brand and fashion as fashion designers and stylists. Now, Karan, and stylist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can I can see his question. So as a um, uh, uh, first of all, Karan, um, when you talk about fashion designer and fashion stylist, okay. As a designer, you need to have all overall knowledge of a, a, a fashion. Uh, it's, it's not only that I uh, I will uh, if you have a uh, it's basically right from the basics to the end product you have to have. So the programs of two three two years or three years program which the various colleges offer, uh, they're good. Uh, and to get to get into the industry or work with fashion designer, definitely you do your course, you do your develop your portfolio, showcase your collection, and uh, then you get your job. That's the basic uh, way of getting into the industry. Fashion. But which designer you want to get? In? There are different designers who are so working with, uh, uh, you're working as a bridal collection, you're working as a uh, regular collection, press collection. And uh, talking about brands, also, uh, it, uh, what is it that how if you completed your collection? Like category, when we talk about category, we talking about men's wear, women's wear, kids wear. What is it that you want to wear? Everybody is not good at. Like I can't uh, design for all the set sector. I'm, I'm specializing in particular skill, uh, set, uh, category. So. You have to, if you like something, then you, are, you get approach those brands if there is a vacancy. And definitely, brands in your portfolio has to talk about that uh, uh, specialization of yours. Okay. And there's one uh, something else. Uh, achha, now we're talking about stylist. Now, stylist is a uh, profession here. We are, uh, uh, first of all, what do you mean by stylist? This may you don't need to have an understand knowledge of fashion uh, uh, technical like you know you don't need to know um, uh, garment construction you don't need to know pattern making but you need you don't you don't even need to know drawing you but you need to have understand the colors you need to understand the uh, colors textures and uh, definitely how would a particular garment would look on anybody how would you create a style for that particular character or uh, as a stylist, how would you, if you uh, like, uh, uh, as a stylist, when you're working for a particular show, like uh, um, a talk show or a new, uh, music show or a, or a what do you say, uh, any uh, um, uh, reality show. So when you're talk, doing the styling for a particular character at that time, you, you just have to uh, manage to coordinate the color schemes, coordinate the ensemble, coordinate. Uh, the screen value and make the whole uh, look for the select or for the uh, what is it your character. So as a stylist, it's a totally different thing. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. okay. And one more also a lot of stylist. students see this career option. Okay. Yeah. So when, uh, as a many times yes, ma'am, you can continue. Yeah. Uh, as a stylist. You actually change the you you create a uh, what is this personality statement for that particular person, okay? A person who comes to other go to a stylist or image consultant, 
and say, uh, if you are a professional, professional stylist and somebody comes to you and say, okay, I want to change my look. Okay. So what do you mean that I want to change my look? So you have to suggest that client of yours, what to wear, how to wear. So knowledge of different products in the fashion line is very important. He will trousers make consi trousers make kaise lagegi consi shirt acha lagega consi collar achhi lagegi consi neckline achhi lagegi a short woman is then if you have to make her look taller then what what suggestion shall i give her if she is as i said be the doctor as a professional professional also when it comes to you to style their looks so you need to understand the character and then you need to suggest that about the uh, 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 garments or looks, or even makeup, jewelry, and hairstyles also, mm. not only garments, it's everything overall. The fashion stylist needs to even know hairstyling, makeup. Okay, so that's how the uh, how to uh, even the types of jewelry. So, suppose somebody wants to create a bohemian look, so bohemian look means kya hota hai? bohemian kya hota hai? So, one needs to, the stylist needs to go and then definitely then they coordinate different. Or, garments and uh, jewelry accessories and they create that look. So they don't need to have a knowledge of pattern making and garment and pattern, but they need to be aware of what is happening in the industry. What is what are the they need to know about the history of fashion. Ki mujhe, uh, right. look tayar karna hai, koi, uh, historical period or periodical uh, movies. Ka. So usme mein kya de rahe ho? Ki, ki, look mein, even the accessories like bindi kaise honi hai, usane, uh, year piece case in home, everything the person needs to research and make the character look. Hmm. Okay. One last question, ma'am. Uh, what suggestions would you like to give to young students, aspiring students who want to get into uh, the fashion industry and looking ahead to career in fashion industry? Okay. Um, See, uh, I'm in this industry and I've been you know, mentoring and guiding and coaching students and uh, seeing different two different levels of different levels of students. You know? uh, students who come after want to go to take up a course, any course, it's not only fashion, anything you want to do anywhere. Right? First, go research for whatever you want to do. Like you know, if you want to get into a fashion industry. Or you want to get into a medical field, or you want to get into a banking field. Is it something what you definitely after 12, you've taken a particular course and you want, uh, you're going to be going towards it. But I've seen lots of students, they don't know just because of the peer pressure, family, family pressure, they take certain courses, a career option, they choose certain career options. And when they actually go there, they say, this is not what I wanted to do. I, I have a students in my fashion courses who have dropped from the engineering program. But they're very good in their creative skills. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I said, you have to do engineering in the fashion. I said, I have my parents and I have a lot of money. So, I have a lot of money. So, you need to go to a career counselor, go to a uh, expert from that field, go talk to them. If, we, uh, if needed, go be with, uh, work with them. See, that will give you more insight into if I should do it or not. I don't want to go read lots, lot about lot, lot about the field, uh, field which you want to get into. So, I will try to know more about it. I don't want to tell anyone that my friend has done this or I'm doing it. I don't want to do it. You have to be very focused on what you do. Don't, don't change your lines there. If you want to so I've seen students, they study for, they keep on changing their, if you imagine this person, I'm going to do another course. I'm going to do another course. It's not like that. If you want to, if you have taken up a particular course, do advanced levels of, and get more knowledge of it. And get, then only, and advancing your skills. Like I, many a time, uh, till date also, I'm in the industry for 35 years, but I still study some of the other, what is happening in industry, what is new come, what, is the, what are the new techniques coming, what are the technologies changing. So I'm trying to be with the latest thing, learn more, study more. Yes, so it's knowing what you want and, and following yeah. your passion. And don't just take decisions in haste. Right, just yeah. Thank you. 
so i guess with that ma'am thank you so much uh, we would like to wish our uh, express our sincere gratitude to you for uh, taking out to a uh, time uh, today with uh, and joining us today on this platform today thank you so much for sharing your knowledge and your experience with us uh, with our viewers thank you for answering all of those questions as well i'm sure the students today must have got a lot more clarity about the fashion industry and uh, i'm sure they have they they will know as to what they would want to do and will follow their passion thank you so much ma'am welcome thanks a lot yeah i wish yeah. you all the best i all would students. also like yes uh ma'am i i would also request dr harish dube sir to please uh, share his thoughts on today's session yeah thank you maria ma'am thank you very much ma'am for giving your insight of fashion design and making our weekend interesting and useful it was wonderful feeling listening to you ma'am starting from fashion design importance and sense of design you very nicely explained the various career opportunities in the field of fashion design in particular you covered uh, for each category maybe what is uh, useful what uh, segment is used for arts commerce science everyone so very nicely covered by you ma'am and uh, we used to listen about what is this fashion design but for us whatever we wear how do we wear that is all fashion but uh, there are so many aspects of that we came to know only out of the uh, delivery which you made today out of this and uh, the various segments like uh, the creativity technology marketing there are so many aspects we were not aware we just used to think ki what is fashion jo hum log pehante hain that is all fashion but uh, there are so many uh, small things into that and uh, we are very uh, thankful to you ma'am for sparing your valuable time for all the students of bk birla college and country as a large so once again i extend my sincere gratitude to you ma'am on behalf of bk birla college our principal director students and everyone thank you very much ma'am once again uh, i i would like to thank as i thank uh, the thank is a very small word for nest academy for organizing this uh, wonderful event in the benefit of the students that is mission skills i am thankful to mr balkrishnan sharma mr vipul uh, solanki ji uh, ms sneha asar today's host ms maria and everyone who made this event very successful and very enriching in the benefit of the students i am also thankful to our management for providing this digital platform in the benefit of the students because of which we are able to organize this mission skill in the benefit of the students and uh, my thanks are also due to all participants who attended today's session and i hope in uh, due course of time also since our uh, lecture is also uh, visible on facebook uh, students can later on also see and uh, let me recommend that this session has been very useful those who want to make career into fashion design and just want to know about fashion design i found this uh, session very useful so i would recommend those who have missed today they must see this video once again and utilize the expertise whatever uh, madam has shared with us thank you very much thank you everyone thank you very much uh, hari sir i would like to thank bk birla call autonomous college to provide us with this platform we are thankful to our honorable director dr narish chandra sir and our principal dr avinash patel and the management of for their st motivation and enthusiastic support a special thanks to the organizing committee of mission skills and a big thank you to all the attendees today for today's webinar and their kind presence thank you all once again who were directly or indirectly uh, who have directly or indirectly contributed towards making the seminar webinar a success once again thank you all